Hello. Uh, today is May 25th, and um, I believe this is the true Star Wars day. Um, it's the 41st anniversary of Star Wars Episode Four, and I think this is the true Star Wars day, honestly. Um, obviously, oh, May the 4th, though, and all that stuff. A very good point, and in a lot of ways, very true, because may the Force be with you, may the Fourth be with you. But let's all be honest, if there's going to be a Star Wars day, shouldn't it be when the franchise began? You know, in other words, when it came out? Um... And today, Solo comes out. Um, now, I have seen it by the time you've watched this, but um, I will wait until Monday to give you my thoughts on the film. Um, I've seen some people review the film without spoilers, uh, just kind of given sort of a general impression. People who I feel are very, you know, reliable. Um, and, um, you know, um, for instance, um, SC Reviews. Um, I don't know if you've ever heard of him, but I think I feel he's very good at reviewing. May not agree with everything. Uh, he says, like, might enjoy a film he dislikes, or I might enjoy a movie more than he does, or perhaps vice versa. Maybe he enjoys a movie I don't like, but overall, I think he's a very good reviewer. He has, a very, he has very good knowledge on what he's doing. And I feel he's one of those people on YouTube and, I guess, internet in general, you could say, that whose uh, thoughts on something like a film that I value. Um, you know, it's very honest. Um, may not agree with what he says on a certain matter, like a film or a even a TV show. Um, um, he might review games. I haven't s seen a game review, though, from him. Um, but I say that because he does have like a poster of Grand Theft Auto behind him. So he does enjoy games. Um, But he's very good. He enjoyed the film. He enjoyed Solo. Um, he had low expectations, but I think, you know, I haven't covered Solo, Solo at all, things people have said, but this is really one of the most unanticipated Star Wars films to truly have come out. So, you know, he had low expectations, and he enjoyed it um it's not necessarily like his favorite star wars film but he enjoyed it he thought it was better than the last jedi it's probably the most divisive star wars film uh, obviously even more so than the prequels um i think with the prequels uh over time uh, you know giving it time a little bit People have lightened up on it, on those films, particularly episode one. The huge amount of hate and criticism that many people who criticized the film kind of nitpicked it, you know, didn't really truly articulate their uh, criticisms well. Um, so, you know, people are kind of re-watching them and kind of reevaluating them. Um, and for some people just won't ever like the prequels, and that's fine. I've always enjoyed the prequels. I enjoyed the original trilogy. I want to enjoy Star Wars. I haven't been too impressed with the sequel trilogy myself so far. Um, hope episode 9 is good. Um, but you know, y y y y you never know. At this point in time, it doesn't look 
real well for episode 9 uh, for someone like me who hasn't really been enjoying this new trilogy but you know you remain optimistic remain hopeful that it'll be a good film I hope Solo will be a good film gonna watch it want to enjoy it and uh want to be entertained, want to be entertained for a couple of hours. That's what I want for my Star Wars day. Um, watch a new Star Wars film, be entertained. I can watch, get home later if anything. Watch the original Star Wars. I love that film. I've said before, that's my favorite Star Wars film ever, episode four. And if I ever had to pick what my favorite movie of all time is, that'd be that one, Episode Four. A New Hope is my favorite film of all time. Or Star Wars, if you aren't fond of calling it Episode Four or A New Hope, or a combination of the two. Just the original Star Wars. That's my favorite film of all time. I often put this series as a whole, just because it's like otherwise we'd be here all day with all the. All the films that are there. Um, but yeah. Uh, very short video today. A lot shorter than I what I normally do. Usually it's between any more 15 to 30 minutes. Managed to be just a little over 5. So maybe I get some sort of points or probably not. But hey, I kept it within a, the intention span of, I guess, most people in the world today. No offense people in the world, but sometimes people just don't want to watch a 30 minute video about someone talking about whatever. In my case, over the past however long, it's, it's Star Wars, so. But, you know, hey. That's all I've got to say, honestly, for now. Today I feel is the true Star Wars day, and I hope you celebrate it well. Hope you have a good day. Hope uh, you enjoy yourself. Maybe watch your favorite movie, read a book, if that's your thing. Watch your favorite TV show. Maybe see Solo, if you are interested. Um, yeah. See you all later. Oh, oh. approaching eight minutes. Well, managed to make it under 10. Good for me. Happy Star Wars Day, again.